Hello. Hello. How are y'all doing? Hi. Hi, Tanya. Doing well. Hi. How are you doing? I'm doing awesome. Happy Halloween to you. And I have my Charlie's Happy Angels Halloween. pumpkin here. We oh, see this. Oh, what a pretty pumpkin. With what <laughs> that, oh, is that a Charlie's Angels? Yeah, thing? it's Charlie's Angels. Sure is. <laughs> I had to make sure I was festive in the season, you know. What was that? Did you paint that on? I did. I sure did. I can make one for you, Mike, and one for you, Tanya, if you want. <laughs> It's fantastic. You're a good artist. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. That's what I do for a living, actually. So I really appreciate yeah, that. I can imagine why, yeah. But I also wanted to show you that I have two of your signature um, signed autograph pictures that you had, um, I guess, given to me a while back. Let me see if I can get this right here. And there's a pink oh, bathing yeah. suit there. And then there is, of course, the one that was done for Christmas a while back, too. Um, and so I, these are my, some of my cherished items. So thank you so much for those. Oh, you're so welcome. <laughs> um, I had a couple questions uh, real quick. Um, did you ever get to meet John Forsyth? And was he ever part of like maybe some cast parties or something since he was the lead, you know, in the, in the title of the show? Yeah, I met him and he was a really nice guy but we never had him in a show because he was just the voice on the voice phone. And um, I met he and his wife and he was really a nice, charming guy and had a great marriage and was really thrilling to meet him because I had heard him all those years <laughs> on, the, on the voice phone. So it was kind of a kick to meet him. Did you guys uh, have someone speak those parts for him or did they actually have the voice phone coming through for you? Oh, while you were they had coming? the voice coming through. Oh, they did. So it made it really he more authentic. It. He recorded That's... it before we shot the show. So That's when so... we shot the show, we'd hear, hey, angels, da ba 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 you know. <laughs> That's cool. awesome. Yeah. Well, and the last question that I had um, is actually before they actually piloted your season, when they had done the photo shoots for you, um, I think that they had, your hair was brown or dark brown or maybe black at the time and they had, had to dye it red. Um, not understanding exactly, maybe just for a variety. But one of the articles that came out said that, um, that you were upset, and this could be of course fake news, so to speak, <laughs> that you were upset that they had to change your hair color and that they over-processed it and all of this. Was that something that you did voluntarily or joyfully or just something I that they- I never said that. I, I love... figured that probably wasn't true. I loved that I was a redhead. I had never been a redhead before, and I loved it. I thought they did a great job. That I don't makes me know laugh. That story, but that's not true. That was the whole reason I asked it, because I knew in the movies afterwards, when you had blonde hair for Sheena, you know, and also I think for your, your oh, yeah. Playboy Victorial, it was, I think it was red for the Playboy Victorial, wasn't it? Or reddish brown? Red, um, red. Red, was, okay. It, that was why. Brown, yeah. Well, at that time, we didn't know that some news could be not true <laughs> or just, you know, yeah. we could, yeah, we could be right. different ways to sell a story. And so yeah. I was like, well, I hope she's not upset and I'm, I hope she enjoys being an angel. Oh, and I, no did it for that way. I <laughs> so. was so happy to get the part. They could have dyed my hair any color. I wouldn't. <laughs> That's so funny. That's so funny. It also shows you what to believe and what not to believe because that was when the Inquirer, of course, was selling stories. And Oh, yeah. And so. they, they sell anything. Anything. Right. They'll say anything to sell a paper. That's true. Well, just know that you were a beautiful, beautiful angel and a wonderful contribution to the show. And we adore you like we do all the other angels. And I even have my Charlie's Angels shirt on, one of the, from the, the dolls. I don't know if you see that. It's yes. so funny. Oh, cool. See? Yeah, it's from the doll, the doll series, which we need a, a Tanya doll and a Shelly doll. I know, it was the last doll. year and they didn't give me a Tanya doll. I would have loved to have a Tanya doll. Well, someone has created one. I don't know who it is online. They did a Shelly or a Tiffany and a Julie doll and it looks just like both of you yeah. to go with the other three, other six total. And it looks fantastic. So if it's online somewhere, you're able to find it. They have a Julie Rogers Someone has created one. I think they did it, you know, um, on their own or had another artist create it. But it is beautiful, and they did you very well. So, <laughs> oh, cool. Maybe I'll see one one of these days. If I, I find it, I'll send it to Mike, and he can send it to you. Yes. 
Well, awesome. thank you so much for joining us. Thank you guys, happy Halloween. I appreciate happy it. Happy Halloween. Thank you so much. Have fun.